Hi guys, today we are going to learn how to quickly organize locations and parent assets, which some people call sublocations. On the screen you can see how we have organized an AC unit and a security system within a building. This is what we will be making. What you first need to know is the difference between locations and parent assets. In Limbo, locations are most often used to separate responsibilities and assets. Parent assets are located within a location and contain child assets. Let's look at an example. Big L Manufacturing has two plants, one in Colorado and one in Wyoming. Jason manages both plants. Robert works at the Colorado plant and David works at the Wyoming plant. Both plants have two buildings. Each building has an air conditioning unit and a security system. Let's talk about how Big L Manufacturing would be organized in Limbo. We know that different people are responsible for the maintenance at the two plants and there are different assets at each plant, so they will be organized as separate locations. There are two buildings at each plant. They may be separate physical locations in real life, however, they have the same technician. So in Limbo, they will be organized as parent assets. The air conditioning unit and security systems are part of the buildings, so they will be organized as child assets. Let's now create Big O Manufacturing in Limbo. We will go to the menu and select Manage Location. Next, we select the Add Location button. We type the location name. Next, we need to add a time zone. We will do the same for the Wyoming plant. To create parent assets, we need to leave the Manage Location screen. We open up our Location drop-down menu and select Manage Assets for our Colorado facility. We will create the Building 1 asset and then create an asset for the Air Conditioning Unit and Security System. Assets can be viewed as cards, a list, or in a hierarchy view. To make sublocations, we need to use the hierarchy view. We move these assets under the building location by grabbing and dragging the four-way arrow button. Now building one is a parent asset. The air conditioning unit and security systems are now children to the building. To create building two, we can copy building one and change the name to building two. One benefit of copying an asset is that all of the information included within it will also be copied. For example, all of the preventative maintenance plans and schedules will be included in the new copy. The same process can be done for the Wyoming facility. Thank you for watching this tutorial. If you have any questions or feedback, please don't hesitate to reach out to us. We are always looking to improve Limbo. Our email address is mail at limbocmms.com. Once again, thanks for watching and have a great day.